this sure looks tasty. Let's pop this in the oven and give it a try. 700, I meant 375 degrees. <laughs> Frozen, I'm gonna cook it for about 20 to 33 minutes. Ooh wee, that looks heavenly. <laughs> Guess who's back, that's right. It's Adrian Finan back with a very exciting food review. Today I'm reviewing this Foster Farms Hot and Spicy Wings suggested by my main man, Pro California. Big ups, he's been a long time fan, a subscriber. So I appreciate the suggestion. So I'm doing this review for you. You guys saw how much I pay? $6.98 and I counted. There are a total of 16 wings, which come to about 44 cents per wing. Now let's take a close up look at the bag. I got this from Walmart. It says family owned since 1939, Foster Farms hot and spicy wings, buffalo style wing sections coated with a flavorful tangy sauce, already incorporated, unlike TGI Fridays which you have to add it and mix it in by yourself. You know what's the spiciness level? It says hot, so it's almost up there. Fully cooked, 0% trans fat per serving, no added hormones, 100% all natural, no added steroids. I'm not sure if that means organic, but it sure sounds good. <clears throat> Net weight 28 ounce, 1.75 pounds. Let's look on the back. Nutritional info, I cooked the whole bag. So which comes to about so have five servings, so five times, 190 calories, wherever that comes to be. And the rest, you guys can do the math. Here we go. Let's give it a go. Let's try one of these tiny drumsticks. It's a good size. The sauce is all mixed in, all around. It's not too crispy looking. Here we go. Wow, that flavor is pretty distinct and exciting because right off the bat, I notice it's not salty. I read on the back it's 360 milligrams of sodium versus I believe it's like 690 on both the banquet and the TGI Friday's wings. Believe it or not, we're talking about almost half the amount of sodium. And I noticed the wings are way juicier. It just tastes good. Let me just finish this up and then I'll try another piece. So as I'm eating it, I notice the spiciness level is kicking it up with that cayenne pepper and that buffalo sauce. On a scale of 1 to 5 stars, I think the spiciness level is somewhere around 3.75. Let's try this final piece right here. This is your... I think you call this like a winglet. Look at that bone, just falls off. Chicken look like it's as fresh as canned beef, even though it's frozen. Mmm. YouTube, let me tell you, this is the best frozen, hot and spicy old buffalo wings I've ever had. It's juicy, it's spicy, it's tasty, and it's not overly salty, which is a rare combo. Hit you like my Tyson's knockout uppercut. I noticed TGI Fridays was formed in 1965 and Banquet Frozen Foods 1953. But Foster Farms, owned since 1939, they've had plenty of time to perfect their wings. And this definitely stands out. Let me tell you, YouTube, definitely check it out. Grab a couple packages of these. You won't regret it. On a scale of 1 to 100%, this gets a 90 4% all day, every day, regardless of rain, sun, snow, or hail. Hope you guys enjoyed the review. Let me finish these wings up. Love you.